So we're really excited um, to have a new baby giraffe. And uh, it was really nice that the keepers were allowed to uh, name their baby. And uh, we have selected a name that is Mastari, M-S-T-A-R-I. And uh, in Swahili, it means line or stripe. And we named her that because her father's name was Stripes. And um, he passed away, unfortunately, last year in September um, 2012. So um, in honor of him, we have named her Mistari. Right now, she's two weeks old. She was born October 17th, 2013. Baby is currently drinking mother's milk. So we've n we haven't had to um, feed her ourselves. So she can um, have milk whenever she wants to, as she's with her mom uh, 24 hours a day. We did have to give her a little bit of a bottle um, on day two because she was uh, not as active as we thought that she would be. So. Um, we gave her a little bit of assistance um, and we had monitored, monitored her through her blood so we knew that her blood sugar was good and she was um, doing well otherwise um, with her vet check so we just wanted to make sure she was doing okay and otherwise uh, she's just hanging out with mom. Probably in the next week or two she'll start to eat uh, or mouth pellets that we feed them and some hay probably. Um, so the day that she was born, October 17th, uh, she and Janetta were out, uh, her mom and Janetta were outside in the paddock um, doing their normal thing and a keeper came by and saw that uh, a leg was coming out of Twigga's behind and so we knew that she was going to ha have the baby and uh, they were brought down through the runway into the house and uh, she had the baby in the, in the house um, on a bed of straw and uh, all went really well. Twigga has had many babies before so um, it was a pretty easy process. Um, it took about an hour and a half to two hours and it all went really well. There were no complications and the baby came out in a normal way. Um, unfortunately for a giraffe they have to basically fall to the ground um, about six feet and that's why they're kind of big so that they can actually take the fall and they come out uh, feet first in order to uh, be able to land on their um, body instead of landing on their head. So if they came out head first they'd have to land on their head and that would be not good. For our giraffes, sometimes if we've had a male, often the um, baby giraffe that was born would have to go away, but we don't have a male right now and it's a girl, so she'll probably be staying with us for quite a while. The baby giraffe will be on display in the yard mainly, um, probably in the mornings only because it's getting colder now, um, so she'll be out for an hour or so in the yard with her mom and her aunt.